Hey there, Internet Drifters, it's Izanami-kun, and I am playing Life in the Village, which is a Minecraft mod. And the intro screen is not looking too great. I don't know what happened. It was windowed, and then I made it bigger, and I even went outside of the whole program and redid it, and it just did not center or something. I don't know what happened. But this is, this, this is what we're doing. Um, I, I, I thought that it looked really interesting. It was more based around a sort of village builder sort of scheme. And I, I haven't played anything like that in Minecraft yet. <laughs> um, it was kind I mean, I know the, um, what I was playing, the farming valley was kind of a village builder. This is supposed to be a little bit different than that. The um, Harvest Valley, Farming Valley thing was more of a Harvest Moon slash Stardew Valley kind of thing. So it was more wrapped around the idea of farming. And this one's supposed to be not that. I don't know exactly what it's going to be, but we're going to find out. Okay. And already there's some sheep. I think those are sheep. They look like sheep. Not very boxy sheep. Interesting. Interesting. Interesting graphic-y thing there. Um, and then, you know, normal Minecraft map. Woohoo! With a tiny tree. The tiniest, the tiniest tree I've ever seen. You want me to destroy this tree? This tree. There's no other tree. Oh, you could be talking about this tree. But... It has really the same problem, but okay. Hooray. I destroyed the tiniest tree. Oh my god, and I have all these weird shit. Starting house. Well, maybe it is more like Farming Valley than I thought. Then I got a quest book. Holy shit. Okay, not like Farming Valley at all. I like this. This right here, this whole tell me what the hell to do. This is cool. Okay, so it tells me I need a crafting table. Well, I already kind of knew that, but that's okay. Basic Minecraft, nothing is... Always start next to a cave. Always start next to a cave with freaking... Zombies in it already. <sighs> Why? Why do they hate me? Why do they hate me? Okay, we're going to plant that there. Where are you? I'm just going to leave that there. I wonder if I ever get a mini map. I really like mini maps. Whoa. Oh, it catapults me. Cataplant. I get it. I get it. That's clever. I like that. Ta-da! I completed a quest. And it marked it off the list. Now I need a stone pickaxe or a crafting pad. What the fuck? Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I want that. Give that to me. Now... Let me just do that. And then, and then it's a crafting pad. Yeah! That's awesome. And I can do it from my inventory. Ha <laughs> ha. That's cool. Basic backpack. Uh, yeah, that's a little involved. So, I guess that's a little more involved, too. I guess we'll we'll go on to do tools. We need some more trees, and I don't want to... Hello, ducky. And cows. And cherry bomb bush. It gave me cherry bombs not to be eaten uh-huh not really
really sure what I'm looking at with most of this stuff, so I'm, sh I'm sure it'll make sense. It, I'm, I'm sure it will, eventually. I can do that and that because I am smart. I don't know what all this stuff is. So doggy charm, command stand, skill book, Tiktopia guide. There's a lot going on there. It's a snail. Hello, snail. There's snails in Minecraft. Huh. I love it. That's awesome. I don't know what these cherry bombs do. I have a feeling if I throw it, I will regret it, though. This looks nice and open, but as soon as I start building here, it's going to feel cramped, and I know it. That's how it always works, isn't it? All right, well, um, so I have this starting house. I don't know what the hell to do with it, so I'm not going to do anything with it. A quest book, stone pickaxe, right... How is that? Fire starter. Well, looky here. What a coinky dink. So much stone. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. I am now in the Stone Age. Woo! Cool, cool, cool. Don't need that stuff no more. Hi. How's it going? Uh, what's my next task? Iron ingot. Kind of a jump, but I get where you're going. Um, yeah, so, about that. I'm not seeing iron on the surface. Sometimes they have it on the surface. That is definitely not something I need right now. Oh, I hear this echoey. Oh, that's crazy. What was that? Diamond shard. I have a feeling that's going to make diamonds a lot easier to get. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, um. So I'm going to run, run, run. And there's a little cabin over there. Don't fall in. Whee! Oof. Okay. Okay, I don't think anything can get to me in here. I am safe. I'm a big wuss. I know. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like, I don't like doing the, um, the, the nighttime thing. So, we're gonna take this time to actually look at this stuff. So, you want me to do, <laughs> Jesus. 
So if I catch everything, then I get... I get a bunch of stuff. Boy, there's so much stuff. Ooh, boy. The Path of Colonizer. Now this... This is what this mod is all about. I don't even know where to begin. Denier. I don't I don't know what it is. Oh, it's crazy. I I assume it's got to tell me, right? Like maybe somewhere in here. Huh. I don't know. Mechanical. Okay, well, I have like two other books. I got this Tectopia guide or Tectopia. Villager Overhaul Mod. 20 complex villager professions and 18 different structure types. Jeez. To get started, visit our wiki. Well, I don't really want to go to the wiki but i guess i will at some point uh what's what's this skill book i have to select a class i don't know what do these classes do So we have artisan which helps us with furnaces and brewing lumberjack sort of Self-explanatory zealot, which is in-your-face combat, which I don't know what the difference is between that and the later warrior class, but we'll, I guess, find out. Miner, spelunker, which is, you know, going through the caves instead of doing, like, mining, mining. Archaeologist, which apparently is another kind of mining where you find more treasure. Farmer, scout warrior all-around combat class i don't know why that is different from zealot but it is apparently hermit which is better at scavenging assassin stealth archer which sounds kind of cool and then fisherman i don't know which one to choose and since this is episode number one how about you put it in the comments so that i can choose next week when next next video and continue on with that one so that skill book is uh it's weird i have rings anyway that skill book is not super useful right now oh they can be eaten but it it says, what does it taste like? I don't, whoa, that's a weird mechanic. It waits for me to eat them and then gives me a description. That's, that's kind of cool. I got these shards. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have converted all of my oak planks. I need to pick that up again. Then Tectopia, I guess I'll uh, check on that. It's definitely still nighttime outside. Okay, after doing some research, it seems... It seems that what I'm going to need to do is find a village and then put down this starting house and it apparently populates me with a bunch of starting equipment and all the tools and everything that I need that I don't have to build all myself. I don't know what this these doggy things are. I should probably check that out too. Okay, it's just what it would seem like. Doggy charm would 
charm a dog and well, a wolf and make it into a dog. Pretty straightforward, I guess. That one uh, we'll probably wait on till we get a handle of things because I don't want a doggo and then and then and then I do something and it dies. Hello, skeleton. I see you up there. So yeah. Oh hey, stuff. I wonder what those are, but I saw them in my questy thing. I'm going to take this with you. Why do, Why does it take so much? Ugh, this takes forever. It's a locked chest. Is that why it takes forever? But it's unlocked. But it says it's locked. Hmm. Anyway, while we're waiting for the sun to rise, because I'm a big chickeny chick chicken shit, um, I will explain why. I am playing this game and not the Harvest Valley game. The Harvest Valley game. It was fun. It was fun. But it's more of a... I feel like it's more of a two-player kind of game. Or a game for me to play off camera and just kind of zone out. It's not... It just didn't seem like it was a, a good game to play and talk and make a video of now maybe i'm just not the kind of person that can can make that work uh, i'm not really sure but ooh, be root seeds <laughs> just finding all sorts of stuff in here just messing around um i just i don't know at the end of the day it really is just that i got bored with the game as a as a video game, well, a game for my videos. So, yeah, I figured it was time to move on. Maybe one day I'll come back to it. Maybe. Probably not, but, you know, I'm not going to say never. So, off to find a village. I wish I had a mini-map. That would make this process a lot easier. And I can, um, in reading the, the wiki, I can make my own village. But it sounds a lot more difficult. To make my own village. So if I can find a village, that would be much better. New building located. 72 meters to the east. That's convenient. Um, uh-huh. He's speaking to me. Is this a town hall? It's wool and some other stuff. Selling to the player. Oh. That's neat. And he'll come in and, and, and sell to me. 
I just go inside of his house and he's there. Hmm. Maybe I should uh, start my village here. Hello, chicken. But this is the only, only house. Well, I'm not going to mark it, but um, do I have an F3? I do have an F3. I will keep that in mind somehow. And come back another time. So it seems if I come into the same chunk as a village or a building really at all, it will tell me that there is a building. New village located! Whoa! What? It just happened right in front of me. Jesus fucking Christ, that was crazy. Cool. Okay, so I need to find a place to set up my house. I don't know if I want it to be so cool close to the town. So we'll go back, go back this way. Actually, where's the... Shit. I lost it. Back that way. Where's the city hall? Because I've played Millionaire before. Well, I played a game with Millionaire in it. This does not look like City Hall. Is this City Hall? That's insane. Look at these little guys. What are they even doing? They're just kind of chilling there. <gasps> he turned around. You guys are crazy. Well, I know there's a town hall somewhere. There's gotta be. Ow. Well then, now I need to find where the body of water went. The snails again. I'm loving these tiny little details. Ooh, I can make different kinds of houses, guys. Desert style, snowy style, basic, ranch, hobbit. That's it. Ranch, I think is probably what we're going to go with. I like that hobbit style, but that, it just looks a little, a little too nature-ish. Shish, shish, shish. So let's do ranch style. Where, where are you trying to put it? I don't want it all the way in there. Put it over here. Preview. No, not there either. Jeez. Ugh. Okay. Wait, what is this? There's something already here. Ah! Pigs. Why are these here? 
I still not outside of the town? Is this part of the town? Well, it's got to be. Yeah, that's got to be part of the town. Okay, so I'm not I'm not out of the town yet. Well, I need to find a place to build this fucking thing soon. The sun's going down. Nah, fuck. <laughs> I scared the shit out of myself. Okay, well... When all else fails... There, now I'm in a little hole. And I will wait out until morning. Don't worry, I'll fast forward for you guys. So I got these rewards for doing these tasks while I'm waiting for the rain and the nighttime and the everything scary in the world to stop. I apparently can buy stuff with that. Like I could buy some leather. I was kind of looking for a mini map because I really like mini maps. Chance cubes. Um, there's also, like, equipment. Interesting stuff. Nope, oh, still dark out. Ooh, there's some sugar over there, though. I'll have to remember that when it's not dark and raining. Oh, no! The wolf was going and eat to eat the sheep. My sheeps. Also, it occurs to me that I'm not entirely certain that I'm far enough away from the village that it won't destroy the village because I'm not sleeping. But I don't have a house yet, and I don't want to set up a house and then it be in a really crappy location that if I had just scouted a little bit I would have been able to prevent that so I guess we'll just have to see what happens and hopefully like that little lightning bug that just keeps flying in the rain there maybe maybe everything's just gonna be okay I don't know what I clicked, but for some reason I now have my FPS counter up in the corner, but I also have the day and time. I don't know what I did, but I'm not going to complain because that will definitely come in handy. What have I stumbled onto? Alert! Look. <gasps> That's weird. V does that. Go to. Huh. Don't know what that does. Don't understand why that would be a thing. Well, I guess it's technically daytime. Not that that's going to stop any of the monsters from getting me. You know, since it's raining. I should have made a sword while I was in there. Oh well, too late now. It's not really too late. I can totally make a sword anytime.
build it. Not too bad. I now have a home. Not super sure why there's glass over that, but that's fine. Ooh, it's nice and spacious. Trap door. We'll check that out in a minute. Furnace. Nothing. Oh, there's actually coal in the furnace. Boy, they thought of everything. Chests. With stuff in them. All right, let's see what, what do you got? Leather stuff, stone stuff, and some stuff. I have two stone, legendary stone axes. Well, you know, whatever. Okay, so that's the upstairs. I've got my bed. And what's down here? Are you serious? They started a mine shaft for me, guys. They started a mine shaft already. It's already started. That is so cool. And look, I've got my iron ore. I don't even have to... Don't even have to do anything. Just, just give me these. And that was... I, oh, I bet that was all the stuff that was. That was all the stuff that was in the line that they dug out. So nothing was wasted. That's awesome. I really like that. That's a that's a cool mod. It's a little cheaty if you're, you know, really trying to do the hardcore Minecraft experience. So cool. And now I just have to wait. Oh, that's right. I had some Stone hoe. And we're gonna put that stuff in here for now. Seeds, beetroot seeds, sugar cane. I wish I had a third one, it would have been perfect. Poof. And then I'll do this better later. Oops, that was not what I intended. Give me that back. Uh oh, it's night time. But I have a bed. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, I really like that. So, I think we're going to stop here. Now it's a little cheaty because, you know, I didn't really have to work to do any of this. But I did have to work to find the, uh, the village. Which, actually, before we go, before we go, let's find out. Are they still alive? Because if they're not still alive, then this may have all been for naught. And then I'll have to figure out how to get another one of those blueprint things and set it up somewhere else.
แม่ Let me out. Well, there's somebody. Hola. They seem to have survived. Looks good to me. They're making some progress. Village map. Where? Ah, there we go. That's what I was looking for earlier. Because <laughs> I knew that Millionaire had this as a thing. I just didn't know what it looked like. Okay, so I seem to have built outside of their town. I, I think. I, I don't, I don't know exactly where, okay, I'm here. I think I built up there. Well, crap. I don't, I don't know where I am. I'm obviously. No idea. What, what does it say about this building? Ah, Cax Makang, is that what the, is that what that is? There, okay, so it's this building, it's the one that's highlighted, okay, that, that makes sense. Okay. Okay, but there's, there's bright red things. I need to, I need to know what... Frustrated Lumberman. Okay, well, anyway, we're going to go back to my basey base place thing. And wrap up this thing, because I have no idea. Where the hell am I? I get so turned around in this place. Ah, okay, there I am. I'm going to need to just tear down this whole foresty area. Why, you ask? Because I am terrible with directions. That's why I like the mini-map, because it tells me where I am. Even though, yeah, I should probably know. Other people seem to be able to know. I cannot. I don't know. I I just, I guess it's, I, I have no spatial awareness or something. Okay, so I might have gotten a little carried away with um, taking out all those trees before I was finished with the video. But hey, you know, now I'll, uh, I'll be able to find my house, in theory. There is a wolf over there. I bet I could make him into my doggo, but I didn't bring the doggo charm. So we'll have to do that next time. It'll it'll probably still be there, right? Probably. Ah, and then I need to build like an extension to make actual an actual farm. Cause I mean this is quaint and all, but this this isn't this isn't no, it's it's not. And I need I need more. I need, I need more than just plants. I need animals and stuff. You know, you know the drill. I'm sure you've played Minecraft. Oh, before we go, let's get that. Ha-ha! And now we can go to here and get that. And now we are on the next set of stuff to do. Like if you liked the video, subscribe if you haven't already, check me out on Patreon, check out my website izanamikun.com and I will see you guys again in the next video.